Hi, my name is Claire. Let's take a look at Convertix to DVD, software you can use to convert and burn any type of video file to DVD and watch on any player. So it's really simple to use. All you have to do is add your video files. So I'm going to add two files here and press convert. And if a blank DVD is inserted, then it will be burnt automatically onto DVD. So let's go ahead and take a look at the other options here. So once your files are listed, you can play them in the preview. Now you have some pixelization, I think, in the recorded video on the screen, but on my screen it plays just fine. So you can play and you can seek through that video file. And um, you can do that for the same on this one. And we can also edit the video file in many different ways. So we can use these tabs here on the bottom to edit. So let's go ahead and click on that. So this is everything related to the audio streams. We can boost the audio if we need. We can add subtitles here if we want to. And we can change and adjust the chapters, the brightness and contrast, the padding and cropping, widescreen, full screen, and we can even cut out commercials, for example, if there are any in the video that we wanted to, by simply using the sliders here and creating the cut sections. And we can also merge files. So I'll show you an example for merge. We can add a file by simply dragging and dropping it into the interface besides using the green plus icon that we used earlier. So I'm going to add CD1 here. And now I'm going to go to the Merge tab. And now if I want to merge another file to CD1, like add CD2, I can just go into my files and add another one. And I see that my subtitles were added there too. So that's perfect. And they were added because they have the same name. So I can also see my subtitles here and I can change the color and all that good stuff. So we can also see that playing here in the preview. Now we have lots of different menus that can be used in Convertix to DVD. Here's a preview of the menu. I can see that just by clicking on DVD and menu options. And so to change the menu, I use this drop down and select a different menu here. And I see a preview live of what that will look like. And there's lots of customization you can do for menus. Change the background image, make put a video in its place, change the duration, change the audio. Anyway, you've got a whole lot of settings here to customize all those things. But here, this was just a quick walkthrough, so it's really that simple. You just add your videos and press convert. And if a blank DVD is inserted, again, it burns for you. So convert to DVD, it's super simple. The quality is great. The speed is great. So check it out. The link to the download the software is just underneath this video. Bye.